So on my more vid, this guy was like, you made bad decisions, but you still did too well. And I'm like, well, let me make another one, but I'll make way worse decisions. And he's like, no, I'll show you what real bad decisions look like. And I'm like, hmm. So he got me gameplay of a full Warzone game, and here I am speculating. Let's see what we have here. Using the air on the ground, so I like it. Rotten got a blast, man. Run out of there, yeah, get that peepee. -pee. Good decision, good decision. Blast out of there. Blast out of there. Boost, crouch, jump. Yeah, I like that, you just... On a decline. Good, Spartan charge. Oh, no! Didn't get to the boss in time, that's a yikes. That's a noofie. That would... That's one thing that would trigger me right off the bat. No boss credit. Hmm. Alright, good shots. Try to get that elite right there. Nice. There's a lot of guys in Monument. Yep, just try to get away. Charge up, PP up. You dead. Got some good teammates on your team. Got some sweaty people with you, that's a fact. That's nice. Nice swift cap on Mon. Oh, I don't know how that wasn't a headshot, that was weird. Just wasn't red, so no magnetism helping you out. Oh yeah, waiting for them. Should have gotten a hit marker, I don't know if you did or not. Alright, what you gonna get, what you gonna get? Or assists, so though, that's a lot. That's what you get for being a part of a base cap. That's good. Good nade throws. Good nade throws. Oh! That was just unlucky. I probably would have gone to the right and then jumped up on the ledge. All cool, though. Got south. So, yeah, I'll just go towards that boss since I see teammates on it I would also try to go to it get some shots on it get a takedown some rec energy up oh, yep don't yeah you just gotta try to not let his jewels recharge <laughs> so make out a grenade on it all right mm-hmm mm-hmm I always go for the body, unless the shields are down, then I instantly just go for the head. Try to get that headshot. Unless someone needs, like, a takedown for it, but it's best to just be safe and snatch it. Mm hmm. Grenade throw. <laughs> you caught someone with an accidentally did jump down into it. That's funny. Pretty normal game. Nervous? Got some sweaty people in this game, man. Do you like popping off with the perfect? That's cool. That's awesome that he's in the game, too. Outrageous Bob, though. He's, oh man. He's outrageous. Oh, they're capping south. Yep, get on that lift and go to south. You know what to do. Or not? Okay, okay. Got cleared. I probably wouldn't have seen that it got cleared and jumped on the lift anyway, so props to you. <laughs> the paper always trips me up, oh my gosh. I see movement and I'm like, enemy! Nope. Fossil arm. He's going for that. So at that range, definitely you want to use your magnum. Carbine is for more long ranged things. It'll be hard to aim with a long range gun at a short range. Um, hmm. Okay, I mean, hey, whatever works, I guess. I would have shot him right at the bat, but he seemed to be oblivious, so... Best to be discreet. Stealthy like that. There's someone down below, like, right under you right now. Yep, he's coming up the ramp right there. 
Blood of Steven, that's pretty cool. Don't know what he was doing. <laughs> Controller probably died or something. Rip. Yeah. Good shots. Ghost Jockey's going down. They got it, they got it. So once you got to four, I would probably get a Subin or a Wasp or a Whip. It's probably not the game for a Whip, though. You need to say that. Oh, good shots. It's friendly. Oh, if only you would have shot him right there. Your reticle's right on his head. Always checking your KD. <laughs> I am the same way. Well, at least was. I'm not sure if I do. 299 uncommon randoms. You gotta sell those. Man, those are for good, good wrecks. Wreck points can change him into something actually useful. Especially seeing as you have everything in the game. All the suits and stuff. That's crazy. Money. Yeah, that translates to 30,000 wreck points. So... Oh, you got a random three. You got a random three. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Not, not something I would do. I normally never really spawn random weapons. I actually get, like, a weapon that I know will do me good for that specific game in that specific situation that we're in. Oh my gosh, they have a lot of guys right there. Hmm. Honestly, if I'm being honest, I probably would have stayed in Monument and I would have gotten on top of Monument if I had a Talon of the Lost. Because then, yeah, I mean, you can then go for the Banshees because they're going to be up there shooting you. So you have the Town of the Lost up there to shoot them with that. So, aim is very jaggy. Mine is normally the same, like right there is smooth. Just try to keep it smooth for best accuracy. It's hard to keep it smooth. It's very instinctive to jag it like that, like that right there. You gotta train yourself to make it smooth, but once you do it, it really gives you some nice perfects and stuff. Eight minutes are coming up soon. So, at this point, 4x with eight minutes come up, I'll just get a ghost to spider them, or just, you know, a whip or a railgun, or like I said earlier, a Susan, and just go to backsmack one and have a good weapon with you to help you out against any enemies that might be there. Definitely do have to be you have to know the boss spawns and stuff, though, so if you don't, then it's completely fine, obviously. In that case, watch my Ultimate Wars on Stratgat. <laughs> Alright, nice leaderboard. Good to be aware of the game like that. Another random. Okay, alright. Blue to soup and not. So, that's the weapon that I would have suggested yet. You got it through a random, which is fine. The thing is about a random, you could get the crappiest thing and then just waste four wrecks of the game. Which for someone like me, I'm kind of sweat, you know. Sometimes I'm goofy, sometimes I'm sweaty. If I'm sweaty, then it's really not something I want to do. Time is very valuable. 30 seconds for one level of wreck to recharge. Little fact right there. Uh-oh. Oh, ah! I don't think you meant to, to fall down like that. Definitely hide behind there and let your shields recharge, let your shields recharge. Don't pop out. They're just gonna keep on shooting you. Gotta let him recharge, and then I'll just turn to the right and blast away out of that car, like where the teammate is on the spiral staircase right there. That spiral staircase. Now they have a they have a sniper looking at you. Do snipers? Really? Oh no 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 no! The teammate has a blood of Subin. Not a blood of Subin, a white scar. That was that was like kind of unfortunate. I don't really know how that guy didn't die. So I'll just try to run and get that back, but. Behind you, there's a boss. Demon's got it. This isn't... If you look at the score, this isn't really a game for bosses, apparently. I guess just slays. Trying to get some nice points. Without going for bosses. Because two bases. Nice lead. Anything can happen. Next bosses are coming up in 30 seconds. Oh. Do like saved you. Yeah. Good job, Dealix. So I'll push up to the right, where that teammate's pushing right there, and I'll go for that person who he just killed. 
I'm definitely more of a pusher. If I need cover, I'll, I'll obviously take it, but... You're just blasting that soup and you're, you're in a pickle. Yeah, I don't know how anyone would get out of here. Ooh, I don't know if so. A DMR is good, yeah, but for closer range, it's actually more inaccurate than a Magnum. Just another little tip right there. DMR is great for long range, but I'm at Magnum range, and definitely the Magnum is more accurate. Ooh, Susan right there. So, yeah. Mm. Definitely try to use it, get them skills. So, I always... Back in the day, I always, if people were AFK, I respected that, because anything could be going on, they could be getting yelled at or, you know, whatever. I respected that, and I didn't kill them, but that's their problem, man. Oh, nice takedown. That's their problem. You, you, you can't go easy on people for getting in a game when they probably shouldn't have, if they know they're going to be busy or anything like that. If people drop their weapon, they might have made a bad decision. They might have just gotten completely unlucky. If they got unlucky, if I see that, I completely understand I'll give it back, but if not, if they just made a bad decision, I'll keep it for myself, because it's better in the hands of you, if you know you're going to use it better than the enemy. That's why I normally never give anything back to people, because I know I'm not bragging or anything like that. I know what to do with everything. I know how to use it to win, so I normally don't really give anything back to teammates anymore. I'm competitive. I'm too competitive. To lose a valuable gun. Smitchy Blaze. I really can't explain why it's an overshield, so the only thing you can do there is spider him. Don't really know how I can critique Banshee. So if I saw him, I would have stood on a circle to the left, so I had more space to kill him. Doesn't take long to do a sharp turnaround to get more area so that you'll be up higher and farther away to then do a flip and banshee bottom. During the dive of a front flip, it increases the speed of the banshee bomb by double. Oh, you're getting lasered. Definitely want to barrel roll out of there. You, you took note of that. That's good. Oh. Nice. Someone just quit. A lot of people are quitting. A lot of people are quitting. I wonder if there was a team on their team. Good kill. I wouldn't necessarily have flipped it there. Only flip. Good advice, only flip when you have to. Because if you flip when you don't have to, and then suddenly there's a laser on you, you need a flip, but then you can. You're basically screwed. Don't want to get in that situation. I always only flip when it's necessary. <laughs> it's a dead body. <laughs> that, that happens to me a lot of the time. I'll see a dead body and just shoot it. Because it's like the enemy color. You're seeing another, another flip right there. You don't necessarily want to do that. So do you like had a laser? And he just died with his laser. So you know they're going to have a laser. So really got to be careful now. Can't laser it any second. Especially since it was like a Selene's Lance, I'm pretty sure. Yep. So I would have kept my article right there. Right there on the entrance of that little tunnel. Because then you would have gotten the kill technically, since it would have it would have been there, and then he was there. So that one, if he's just taunting you like that, just go away. He'll he'll go out eventually, or not, because of the score. Oh my! Oh my! All right. I mean, hey, you won. There wasn't any crucial situation where you had to either like had to kill a boss or had a cap of base or anything like that. It was a very easy laid back game. That's what I prefer. Teammates that know what they're doing. Alright.